Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Dale and today I'm going to be listening to The Police Message in a Bottle. So apparently I used to listen to The Police when I was like a little baby, but I've never actually consciously um, listened to them. My mum said that I used to like dance around to The Police, but I have no recollect recollection of ever listening to The Police. So I would like us to listen today. Okay, so far I'm liking it, I'm liking it. I think that's a really cool uh, bass line that they've got and uh, the riff that they're playing as well. Um, I think I've heard this riff sampled in a song before, which I'll see if I can find after, but yo, I'm liking this so far. Um, themes of um, feeling isolated and alone, that's what I'm picking up so far, like asking for someone to come you know, save him from himself, maybe, um, like a desire for like human interaction. I'm not, I'm not too sure. We'll keep listening. You know, it's mad. It's weird, but I'm getting like kind of like reggae, um, in, like influence and inspiration that I'm hearing while listening to this. You know, just how um, he's singing and pronunciating things. Um, yeah, I'm getting reggae vibes. It's weird, but I like it. I like it a lot. And it's interesting because like the title of the song is Message in the Battle, but um, the um, the part that they've given it to in the song is like the most, probably the most stripped back and relaxed part um, compared to like, you know, the um, I'll send an SOS to the world and the um, actual verses, which are a lot more um, upbeat. So I, mean, I, think, I think that's, in that's interesting still. Yeah, really sick, really sick. I really like 
just all the um, guitar riffs and elements. And it seems in the lyrics that um, there's like a realization that we went from like feeling on- lonely and isolated to now like you're saying that he saw um, a billion other bottles um, from other people, which kind of shows that he's not alone in his feelings of isolation. Um, he's he's understanding that there's a lot of other people that are feeling the same way as him, which is in, which is cool. It's interesting because it's like now he's not really alone, even though he's alone. You know what I mean? Yeah, I, I love this riff. This is fire. This is fire. be a really big song i imagine like it's it sounded iconic um i've actually heard this riff sampled in a song um so it must be a, quite a big um big influence um uh, what, should, what what year was this filmed in it's looking like early 90s late late 80s early 90s i'm not too sure but yeah, the police seemed like a vibe. And yeah, I was definitely getting some reggae-influenced vibes in that. Um, maybe, I don't know if I'm tripping, but yeah, yeah, I definitely felt like that. Um, I would be very interested to hear more of the police. Um, I'm going to pull up that song that I, I heard it sampled in just to make sure um, it's called... Yes, that is what it's called. I'm sure this is the same riff that uh, that I've heard. Oh, that's one sec. But yeah. It sounded familiar, yeah. So that this is where I've heard that um, riff from, but they've obviously sampled um, the police, and yeah, it's just like a little grime beat. Yeah, but um, yeah, I just thought that was interesting because it's it's mad how um, it's mad how much um, influence. Um, older music can have on like the new generation and even like urban underground artists like they listen to this stuff and get inspired by it it's really cool um so how many members are in the police let me have a look one two three four oh sting okay is that In my head, I thought that was like the you know the wrestler or something. I don't know. I don't ever really watch wrestling, but um, awesome. Sting, Stuart Copeland, Andy Summers, Henry Padovani, English rock band formed in London in uh, nineteen seventy seven. Nowhere. So they started late in seventies. Um, and they became really popular in the late seventies and early to mid eighties. Okay, so yeah, oh, so they make new wave, reggae, rock, post punk, pop rock. So yeah, the fact that I was like picking up on the reggae elements that makes sense now. Um, but yeah, that's awesome. I would love to listen to some more of the police because um, I thought this was absolutely sick. Um, so 
Please, guys, please give me your favorite police song and drop me drop it down below, and I'll definitely have a, look, a check it out. And be sure to subscribe to keep up to date with the latest reactions. And yeah, hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.